Alright guys, this video is going to be kind of a video dump of the Ponies in the Smokies trip. Got a couple things I want to say before I just release all the footage. Shout out to the guys that put on Ponies in the Smokies. Guys and gals, I guess. Great event. I can't imagine what it would take to put on an event like that. Shout out to my crew. You're going to see them on here. We had a good time. Um, this trip was kind of more about me hanging out with uh, my friends. Spent some time with my friends and doing the the bibster thing, but um, I really wanted to experience it with them. So as you can see, we took the couch, we took the whiskey barrel, we took all kinds of stuff. Almost took the mini chopper. We wanted to kind of feel like the shop a little bit up there. It was crazy though because uh, people were just Random people were just kind of sitting at our tables and on the couch. I guess it looked awfully inviting. We also took a couple cars. We took Chad's car. Um, buddy Brad took his car. We were going to put them in the show, and then like last minute we decided we wanted to drive them. And if they're in the show, you can't drive them. So we just decided Bibster only in the show. We'll keep the other cars out so we can get out and kick around and drive around in them. So the one other little part I guess I probably need to explain in this is there's gonna be a, like a sweet 97 uh, Mustang in there at the end. That is that is the winner of the Fab Forms Choice Award. So that was the award that we gave away while we were there. Um, we like to gear our awards more towards cars that have a lot of fabrication done to them. And then um, we're particular about the owner it, themselves. You know, we want owners that drive and race and do the work themselves and that sort of stuff. So that was our choice. Great car. David Edwards was the winner of that, winner of that award and uh, good dude, good car. So we actually brought him in the convention center at the very end after everybody was kind of leaving and took some pictures. What are you doing, son? Oh, you got some pictures, huh? That's right. Go. That's good. Like that.
I'm gonna get you and Rick on. Yeah, me and Rick on. Somebody told me when I came up to Trashville, son, you finally got it made. Oh, hang a minute here. Well, sure as you will. I don't think hang it done on this way. Yeah, I don't think hang it done on this way. My young life away Tell me one more time So I can tell the man Are you sure Hank is done on this way? Well, Hank is done this way So, uh, tell me about Bill, tell me what progress is it Like, what stage are you at? What are you planning? Um, what is it? You know, what are you going to use it for? Is it a race car? Okay. And uh, basically, anything else you want to tell me about? Like, if it's if you're involved with any other, let's go ahead and do it. And uh, we'll go from there. I'll set you up right here just so we can have the car in the background. And definitely, definitely. If you have that little tool, would you show us the ribbon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Mr. Boss, walk me through. What, what are we looking at? This is a uh, 88 box like it, but it is. This was something I kind of had in my head for a long time. I'm kind of a hot rod guy. I've always been a fox rod guy. I really wanted to do something a little wild. I had a friend of ours that passed away in like 2006. His name was Chad Bibb, which is why it's called the Bibster. Uh, he probably wouldn't have built something like this on his own, but um, you know, kind of an homage to him. We, we or a tribute to him. We built this, and uh, we just wanted to stand out in a crowd of bunch of nice cars, something a little different. I'm a high ride guy, so we basically took a Fox body and made it into a high ride. Well, so we push the controller up and up, or we can just stay in here. Nobody likes me around here. Huh? What is it? It's a Mustang. 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 Oh, she's coming back down. Oh, I see it. It's in front of her. Oh, right. Yeah. It's in front of her. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. She's struggling. Oh, yeah. I see it. Oh, there's another one. They can't He's get He's standing up. on his feet. I'm going to bring me a whiskey. Wish I had a good girl to miss me. Oh. I don't know. They say cook bacon. I don't For know. For the salad. For the salad.
Oh, there we go. So the video title, I Won. Well, I didn't necessarily win anything from the show, but I think I just win overall. You know, when you have a really good crew, group of friends around you, always trying to prop you up. You know, I have a ton of fans out there that watch the channel. If it wasn't for you guys, uh, I wouldn't be able to do this. So I think in the end, I feel like I won. Thanks to everybody for stopping by. If I didn't get to talk to you, I'm sorry. There was a ton of people that came through. Um, maybe I'll catch you on the next one. Anyway, y'all go do work, son. <laughs>